greater speed than you are doing. <laughs> please don't, this is serious, but I've been in this situation where we're trying to get in. So please don't block them, give them the, every chance of getting safely past. Pull over and be considerate to the masters and apprentices. Rally time is Eastern summer time and have been checked and is down at the start control. <coughs> Mobile phones are only to be used in emergency, but it would be appreciated if they were left on uh, in your vehicle so we can contact you if we need to, especially if you're running late or lost.
Edgeport. I could be a lot of things. Thing. Okay, Daddy. What sort of a run have you had today? Oh, absolutely magnificent. What car are you driving today? I'm um, driving a 1968 BMW 2.2Ti. A very shiny one, as I remember. No, no. Well, full of dirt now. <laughs> After 50 kilometers of dirt. And who's navigating for you? Uh, Tony Hudson. Oh, 
right, you've got pulled him out of retirement. Uh, yeah, out of retirement after this is the first rally after seven years ah, right. of retirement. How's he doing? Very well, very good. Uh, we find out after the first day we are six. There's more six in our class, which is the apprentice. He's quite good. Very good. And hello, Doug. What are you driving in the event today? I'm driving the, uh, the green 911. How's it going? Well, it's missing a headlight now after the dirt roads. <laughs> it's now the, it's now the, the uh, one-eyed Kermit for a road wheel. Some people are happy with their results. Yes. Some are devastated. But you know what? It just goes with the flow. Is he holding me? Yes, he goes. He's doing. <laughs> what? How's David going? Great. Is he? Yeah. Your husband, why shouldn't he be going great? Well, that's it. And he's married to a very sexy wife. So why shouldn't oh, he? Be I've heard that. <laughs> This is actually a movie. Oh, right, okay. So you could have a problem there. <laughs> well, yeah, can you take a still out of it for me? <laughs> so, how, how's your run? More challenging than I thought, having just seen the scores. Now, we're having a really nice day, enjoying it. Trying not to think about the scores. How's Bob going? Bob Moore. And what a dreaded vehicle are you driving? Uh, this would be a BMW 318iS. Right. And how many Classic Rally events have you done? Oh, about six, I'm guessing. Mm-hmm. Okay. And are you enjoying this event? That's Within the... reason. <laughs> Some excellent roads, lovely countryside. And? Good challenge. Mm-hmm. How's your navigator been going? He's challenged. You're still speaking to him? <laughs> 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 Are hey, you Westy? Hi there. And you're in the mighty P76. Yes, we are. How are, you, how are you enjoying the P76? It's wonderful. The uh, cocktail cabinet re works quite well. All right. Yeah, so we're, we're really happy about that. Ah, excellent. <laughs> and Garth's keeping you out of trouble? Well, he, the, the wine spills on, on tight corners. Oh, dear. It's such a problem. <laughs> so, how's it going in the pink Saab? The pink and yellow. Yeah, yeah. It's going very, very well. Mm -hmm. We have a, a slight problem next to the steering wheel. What's that? Mike Stevenson? Yeah. Mr. Stevenson forgot to wake up this morning. Did he? Until about quarter past ten, I think it was. Really? By which time uh, we were already 20, 14 kilometres on the wrong road. I see. Yeah. Ah, okay. Minor uh, details. Minor details, and I've only kicked him in the head twice for it. I think he deserves more. But uh, we'll give it to him in good slow time. Do we have right of reply, Mike? We were both asleep this morning. Ah, I see. Okay. So, David, how's the uh, how's the sunbeam going? Going pretty well. Mm -hmm. It's a bit warm. Tomo behaving himself? Yes, he is. Mm. How's the navigation? <laughs> Navigation today, I'm doing okay. Mm. What yesterday about yesterday? I had a few issues. Uh -huh. 
Are you enjoying yourself? Yeah, yeah it's always great. Fun. Oh, that's good. And did you say the sunbeam's a bit warm? It is sitting in the open today, ah, yeah. Yeah, right. <laughs> so it's great to be warm and not wet. That's true. <laughs> David tells me the sunbeam's pleasantly warm. It is, it is, it is. It's, it's, you're getting the colour of my nose? Yes, I am. Dead yeah, right. Yeah. Dead. Mm. And I'm using sunscreen, Mum. <laughs> <laughs> and how's David performing? Very well. He's spending less time on the phone than he normally speaks. I think he must have relinquished some of the control ah. of the work ethic. Or his kids have stopped playing soccer. One of the two, I'm not quite sure. Right. Right. <laughs> so more concentrations going on in navigation as opposed to Facebooking people, which is always an advantage I find in these sort of places. So Shane, how's the Porsche going? Oh, the Porsche is going great. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Bit, bit, bit uncomfortable on the dirt roads, but other than that, excellent. Nice black car and all that dust yes. too. <laughs> Plenty of power, lovely no note. <laughs> and what about Jan? Is she going okay? Yeah, she's doing the mapping uh, quite well. She's enjoying it this time. Oh, very yeah. good. The average speed went well, I think. We'll find out in the long run. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, good. So how's, the Carmen, how's the Carmen gear going, mate? <laughs> very well. <Yeah>? Very well. <laughs> it's struggling on the hills. Oh, poor little thing. Poor thing. <laughs> And what about Star? How's she going? Star? Star? Yeah. So this one over here. <laughs> that one. Yeah. How's he going? More to the point. Is he making you horse, dear? Yeah, absolutely horse. <laughs> oh. Hasn't he been obeying instructions? No, I don't even know the instructions myself. <laughs> Did you have a good time? Absolutely. And what were you driving this time? I wasn't. Oh, you weren't, of course. What, what car were you in? I was in the Infinity that my wife was driving, that we've used in the last couple of events. Definitely need a vehicle that's able to keep up to the pace required in this event. Mm, fair enough. And the driver in question? Okay. <laughs> 
How did you go, Wendy? Um, well, I think. Poorly. Ah, okay. Ah. We're hoping so. <laughs> well, what about the car? Did the car go? Around? The car handled beautifully. Ah, that's very good. Yeah. Did you like Hill End? Yeah, it was quite the adventure. <laughs> a lot bigger than what I thought it was going to be. A lot bigger than what it was going to be five years ago. So, my point is, you can't be good at least. When are you going to do that? I can't. I didn't see the oh, car. Yeah. I, think I, I thought you were referencing yourself. Oh, no, no. I couldn't passively be referencing the car. I always do. The car just is amazing. Even, yeah. even, the, even the locals noticed the pink and yellow sub. The ice cream. Yeah. Yeah, they get polished in ice cream machine. The alpha go. Right. Fantastic. What can you say? Love it. I've done a lot of rallies. How's your navigator going? Oh, pretty bad. Yeah? It was one of his worst ones, but hey, really? I'm smiling. Yeah. 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 Okay, Tim, so here we are at the finish of the Alpine. How did you go? I had a fantastic weekend. Very good. So what were you driving? It was a Mini Cooper S. Yeah. Very reliable. We had no problems at all. We just kept churning away over the kilometres. Over the dirt road. Bumps and all. Who's been navigating for you? Uh, Ron Cooper. Ron's been navigating for me for 15 years. Right. We partnered each other. We both uh, shared driving and uh, navigating duties together on and off, so it's been great. For Ross is a jolly good fellow, for Ross is a jolly good fellow, for Ross is a jolly good fellow, especially if you're compassed. <laughs> And how many controls have you done before, mate? This is my 16th year and I've done four controls a year, so quite a few. So you're a bit of a learner then? Yes, I'm learning every every rally I learn something new. And usually the competitors are the ones teaching me, or trying to.